So I asked Emanuele to show us uh, the application he developed and his favorite application and to show it on this, on this big, <laughs> like exciting iPhone that we have in here. So, Emanuele? So, um, let's start with my favorite application. It's called Tweety. It's a Twitter client, one of the best Twitter clients for iPhone. As you can see, it's very minimal. Uh, it's got this tab bar here. Uh, Many iPhone applications have this, this kind of uh, control at the bottom, this is called a tab bar, but Tweety adds a little touch, it adds a little arrow to know, let you know where you are. Yep. It also adds a little light to let you know there are, for example, I have a new message here, I could touch this icon and see the new message, okay. but you're not going to read my mail. <laughs> it's another thing that makes... Uh, uh, this application treating so compelling is that it's got attention to details. For instance, uh, when you write a new tweet or to, se to send to Twitter, you can write something. It's very clean, see? And there's nothing much, there's a close, there's the keyboard. I can s write, hi, I'm Word. But if I, could, if I touch here, Key, the keyboard slides down and there's all, all sorts of control, for example, to let no people know where I was when I wrote this, or adding a photo, add, uh, send this to a username. Very, very nice, it's a, it's a little touch. It's just below the keyboard. <laughs> it also lets you save tweets to send later. I'm not going to so say that's this. not common, I mean, it's... it's there are, these are little details that people using Twitter like because other applications may be a little more lax and have not so much uh, let you write a tweet but maybe a phone call calls while while you're making the tweet the application quits it restarts and it's lost the tweet first okay it's also got uh, some ni other nice feature features you can search twitter but you can also see people nearby so i don't uh, they're shown on a map yeah. So I these mean. are like other Twitty accounts nearby Yeah, other, tweet, other people using Twitter that have chosen to have their account uh, okay. to their the tweets located on a map. Does this they can have simply touch one and it appears. Does this have anything to do with the application you are developing? Yeah, we will have a similar feature where events will appear on a map yep. and uh, they, will, uh, show, they will be shown uh, as little pins on the map, so you can see where it is, how, how big it will be, all sorts of nifty stuff. Okay. <laughs> um, Let's go to your application. My application, just a moment. Uh, oh, uh, here we are. So when did you develop it? Oh, I developed it, in, I started developing it in May. I've made a new uh, a new version this uh, this October. It's called Mover. There's two versions. There's a Mover Lite version that's free and the Mover Plus version that's not free, <laughs> but re it's really really cheap. What is it for? Your uh, application? It allows people to share data share data with style. For instance, now we're going to use Bluetooth because the uh, Wi-Fi network is busy with showing the application. I have another phone here that has mover and fortunately Bluetooth is a little yeah, bit here, you go. Here, it, here it is, touch, connect. So these are two phones who have both your phones. application. This is my phone, this is the demo phone. Uh, they both that? have your application. They, uh, they can be paired. So. The name of a phone appears at the edge of the table. <coughs> yeah. I can add a photo, a video for 3GS, iPhone 3GS, or a contact from my address book. Okay. That's me. They appear like small slides on the table. I can move them with my finger. Oh. I can hold my finger on them. So I, I can choose to show them or move from the table. But the, the cool thing is I can pick one and go. And it appears on the other side. Maybe you didn't see it. So, so I'm going to do the same. So you can see how it, how it appears when you send it back. 
Come on, guru. Looks up. Whoosh. It appears. It, you didn't have to do anything. It's automatically saved to your address book. You can do the same with images, uh, video, uh, text clippings. And if you shake the phone like I'm doing now, it says, hey, you're shaking the phone. Do you want to clear all the items off the table? Why not? Poof. OK. <laughs> cool. And that's it. It works on Bluetooth and on Wi-Fi. On Wi-Fi, it's much faster. Good. Thank you very much, Marwini. <laughs>